Hello everybody and welcome to another Exile tutorial video hosted by the Gaming Junkie for an Arma 3 Exile dedicated server. Hello everybody and welcome back to another tutorial video for an Exile server. Today I'm going to show you how to set up the script for IGI load. Alright, this is actually a request that I got off of YouTube, so... Alright, let's get going. First thing you want to download download it by going to hang on oopsie you can do it here or go you know to armaholic which I actually prefer armaholic but since we're already here I'll put the the link in for both locations in the, in the box below. Oh, this one's actually better. This is not the one I got. I know that that's done. We open up here. Go to downloads. Unpack. See, I've already got one that I've been working with, and that's this one. But this one has a README file that didn't come with the last one, so that's kind of nice. Oh, I got the wrong one. Wait a minute, which one did I download? Exile. Okay, got it. Okay, yeah, this one's different. Good. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and start over. All right, open up your mission file, what you want to put it in. I am working with this mission today. What you do is backtrack, copy all this, put it into your mission file. Yes, overwrite it. Same for this file. Then you look, open up your initiate, and the same one. Oopsie. I accidentally started my server. Didn't mean to. And you pretty much just copy this over onto this, which I can't really tell if they're the same, so we're going to just copy it anyway. Which they are. Okay. And then you save it. Who knows? I might actually get this done before it starts. <laughs> Doubt it, but anyway. Now we're going to make that minimum. We're going to minimize that area, that area, that. Turn it. That area. Turn it. That area. That area. Go down here. Now we're just going to type in the name, exile, client, underscore, object, underscore, player, underscore, event. Actually, let's see if this is in a freaking readme file. Yeah, there it is. Look at there. This makes it easier. But as you can tell, it's missing an E. So let's see if this is missing an E. If so, then nope, it's not. So what we need to do is fix that. Then. And then type in SQF. Now we're going to save. We're going to cancel my server. Go ahead. No, we're going to wait for a second. 
Be right back. All right. Make sure you also put the. Dang, I can never remember what that common thing is. But anyway, make sure that's in there. Save because I'm uh, glad I took a break because my daughter was asking me something because I would have screwed this up. Okay. Then what, what you want to do next is now if you want to edit the file, you know, add stuff and everything. What you do is go into the mission one. Mm. Go into initiate. Nope, wrong file. I do apologize for that. Don't need that open. Don't need that open. Don't need. No, don't need that open. And don't need that one open. Then what you do is go into the IG. I load. Now this is where you edit all the information for like the vehicles you want. Here's all the off-road vehicles. Here's all the off-road vans. Here's the copters you can add. All you want to do if you want to add more to this is just you know go in here, add a comma, quotation marks, and then just add in the vehicle you want. Which I don't. I'm not gonna take the time to do all this stuff. But yeah, this one's a lot better than the last one I just tested. So yeah, this one. Ooh, yeah, this one adds everything in. So yeah, this one's really nice. Okay, but as you can tell, that's where you edit the stuff and then just save it. Which I'm not going to bother editing it. So no. And then what you do next is pretty much just start your server up. So we're going to go back to my test server. Go down to start. Wait for it to pop up. I'm going to pause the video and I'll be back when the server is, you know, up and running. Alright, as you can tell, my server is up and running. Got the game up, so what we're going to do is go ahead and go in. Waiting. Okay. Good, I'm in my little admin base area. I got lots of zombies on this one, and I may left them off this base area so I can have a little place to do some testing. All right, so what we're going to do now is wait for my admin tool to pop up. Yep. So anyway, there's my HQ. There's my second HQ. There's my guard tower, guard tower, radio tower, radio tower. I honestly don't know why that's over there and not here. There's my visitor's barracks. You know. Oh, okay. Admin's done. Alright, now what we're going to do is spawn in two vehicles. Uh, let's get a helmet. Alright. There you go. Now we're going to back up. And we're going to spawn in a, squ a quad. QUAD. No, why did y'all son of a beep? Why did you move forward?
Yeah, bandits. Okay, now what we're gonna do is go up here. And we're gonna give you a good view. Hmm. I can never remember how to get out of these things faster. Okay. Is the Hemet even part of that group? Because when I was doing the test before I started recording, it was working perfectly, but I did not have this version of it, so... Oh, darn it. So, here we yep. I bet you I don't have the right quad. Alright, let's type, do a search, because I might not have the right quad. Right, quad bikes. So I need to see which ones these are again. Probably don't have the right ones on. Black and white. Yep, I bet you that's what's wrong. If you want to know what I'm doing, I'm looking to see what is actually supported for this Hemet, so... Where'd my search go? Huh. Well, let's find out if it's just the bikes first. So... Delete. Okay, so what we're going to do is spawn in the right ones, hopefully. Yeah, that's what I did. It's the exile ones that only allow. Let's find out. As you can tell, I had the wrong quads. Now, what's nice about this script... Oh, oh. What's nice about this script is you can supposedly do it from here, too. Yep. Aha. Yeah, that's nice. Okay. Oh, back up.
Alright. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you set up the... Let's shut up the engine. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, that's how you set up the IGA load script for Armor 3 Exile. Alright, uh, give me a thumbs up if you liked the video, and come on people, hit the subscribe button. Have a good one.